Hi, welcome to Free Spirit and welcome to the Real Divine Abundance reading for August. So I actually thought that I already did this reading because so much has been about getting divine help with material needs that I actually thought I did this, but I didn't. So let's tap in. We're going to tap into five decks. It almost looks like my Selenite heart has a crown, but to join us for the abundance reading, we have this gorgeous pyrite to bring in real divine abundance. So I thought let's have this join us for this reading so to support real divine abundance in all forms but it just looks almost like a crown <laughs> so we're going to tap into the sacred wealth code so what are the qualities that would help us the most for the month of august when it comes for and comes to real divine abundance in all forms so let's we're going to tap into that we're going to tap into angels of abundance for messages from the angels that could help us with real divine abundance we're going to literally tap into the real divine abundance deck and get direct spirit messages for real divine abundance what are they saying is the most helpful for the month of august we're going to tap into divine spirit messages direct guidance when it comes to real divine abundance and of course we're going to end it with pure love from spirit which I feel like this all is so for the month of August I just want to tap in here and see what are our sacred wealth codes what would be the most helpful what are the qualities that would best serve us that we already have and embody that could help us bring about real divine abundance in all forms in all forms so let's see what other qualities would be the most helpful in all forms for August? What, ooh, wow, with force. Did you see that? We are all one and it fell right on the heart, the selenite heart and the connector. And this is Venus. Right here, I'm just feeling like a connector with people. You know, we kept on saying like others are going to help you. People are divinely helping each other. That's what immediately... Um, leaped out at me also this is red this is very heart-based and so there were, are going to be a lot of heart-based connections and then we're all helping each other we're all being divinely used to help each other has been a recurring message if you didn't see the akashic records reading for august and uh, several other messages we've gotten about that so we are one so yeah so this is like they said heart-centered intimate creative communicative diplomatic devoted harmonious, inspiring, what is this? Accommodating, receptive, compassionate, empathetic. We are all one. Really coming from this heart-based place, following your heart. We've been getting that over and over again, what's aligned to you, and it's very heart-based. And also that's where you should be connecting with others from, your heart. And from this, we are all one kind of perspective. And so this could be a real, I almost am getting collaborations, maybe because there are three in here, but this is very heartfelt communications and you wanna be coming from your heart space uh, for August. And it is highlighting uh, the things that leaps out on me, the communication, right? Um, this empathy, um, and just being very heart centered. And so that's gonna really do, and it landed on the heart. And this is the selenite crystal heart. So make no doubt about it. It's like coming from your heart in all your connections when it comes for real divine abundance. So whether you're coming from your heart or good connections, but it's very heart based. And I feel relationships are some kind of, you know, we're all helping each other and it's uh, staying very heart based and that's gonna do you very well. Okay, so let's see. That's easy because we, we want to come from our hearts anyway. So that's so very heart based. That's okay. There, it's almost like no other cards are coming out. So it's connecting with others from your heart base is an explanation mark because now it's getting to a Yeah, I knew this was going to come out. And then the strategist, the strategist, every vision has a plan. And so this is making those very strategic, very grounded, very practical. We kept on getting, um, the King of Michael moves and the Queen of Michael. So this is being very strategic, very detailed in the moves that you're making and being the strategist. So the qualities to have is yes, high achieving, yes, productive, calculating, passionate, decisive, ambitious. Uh, they've been talking about that. Enthusiastic, systematic, competitive. I don't like that word competitive. Active, tactile, goal-oriented, and persistent. Um, 
and gritty but i would say this persistence you know they kept on talking about the stamina of things this is being strategic every vision has a plan and what are the moves and you're being helped along the way i think they're helping you with the moves and also through your connections um you know there's a lot of things that we're connecting with other people for the moves and come from your heart when it comes to the moves but i also think we're all hoping each other um you're gonna find in the moves um so again you know we are all one being very heart centered and connecting with others here and yeah it, every vision has a plan they want you to be enthusiastic has been leaping out over and over and over again and i would almost say methodical why is methodical and it's not even one of these but very strategic and um yeah systematic compared it just reminds me of being very grounded and strategizing with the moves here i want to see if we can get one more card so with connector the strategist oops calculating I, I love when it high achieving, decisive, ambitious, enthusiastic, systematic, active. It's making those practical moves in the physical, coming from your heart and making those practical moves. But I also think also that the helpful people or other people are gonna be very helpful this month. And that's been a recurring message through contacts. Um, and then you're also strategizing. What are your next moves? What are the moves to make? And you're getting to find help with that. It's been a repeating message, whether it's through your connections and then also um, just personal divine guidance. You're getting help with the strategies and the moves to make. And the last one is the messenger, Mercury. Yes, I bring the light of awareness and look at that. So this is all gonna be about perceptive. Yeah, they were saying that in the Akashic, progressive intelligent, adaptable, changeable, yes, psychic, yes, versatile. Didn't I see you're getting this, um, you're getting this that's helping you with the strategies and the moves, um, especially with psychic. They said it was off the charts. Uh, communicative, absolutely insightful, again, which is very much like psychic, imaginative, curious, and instinctive. Sorry, I'm trying to read it through the camera that's holding it. I'm in a new setup. But this is, you're receiving divine guidance when it comes to the moves. You're getting it directly, the help and the guidance with the moves. And then you're also getting it from others and also very highly communicative, right? So a lot is coming through your communication, but the psychic insightful is very off the charts. See how she's like almost alone there. And it's almost like it's being, and here again are the birds. We kept on getting that with the Queen of Michael. They kept on bringing our attention to um, birds and the messages. They are using everything to connect with you. And you're probably getting a lot of insight on how to make your moves, how to make those moves. And it is following your heart. But at the same time, I also think while you're making the moves that you're also, it's a connective kind of energy here where it's bringing helpful people that are going to help you with the moves with to succeed. So that's what I'm getting from this card. So so what are they saying come very heart-based and you're also being very strategic here basically and then here it's very intuitive and psychic and then also you're being very communicative um but um those are going to be the qualities for the month of august to implement let's tap into the angels right now i just want to move right along i want to get the angel messages when it comes to this these are the qualities that would best serve us in august heart-based making those moves very insightful and psychic and also just very good connections yes the number one card is deservingness deservingness look if you didn't see the other messages from august there were so many things like what goes around comes around like what you've been putting out you're going to be getting on the return and there's some kind of level of deservingness to drink in in august so they are literally saying you are a beloved child of god like everyone else and you deserve to receive the support that will allow you to focus upon your divine life purpose even if you can't yet recognize your lovable qualities trust that god and the angels can see how amazing you truly are. And there's something about this deservingness and I have waves right now. So this has been a, a permeating energy of this love and how special and deserving you truly are. Um, so when it comes to real divine abundance, how deserving you really are. That's what they're saying, how deserving you really are. So that is so beautiful. I almost feel like things are going to be working out, which has been a recurring message and that you're having help with the moves to make in the physical that will bring this in and that you deserve it. 
And that's been a recurring message that you deserve this. Like everyone else, you deserve to receive the support. Yes. And even if you can't see your lovable qualities, trust that God and the angels can see how truly amazing you really are. Do you know how many times I did a spirit pick me up reading or the, we used the free spirit cards and they kept on saying, we know how good you are. We know how good you are. So there's something about that. It's almost like talk about helping you to come from your heart because they're feeding you that kind of love um, that you're amazing. And uh, okay. And the next one message from the angels when it comes to abundance is unlimited ideas. What did I say? The psychic insight, the ideas that could be coming to you that can help you with the moves or the strategies for more that they're literally helping you with. And it's unlimited ideas. And I've chills with this. And I literally just lived this card actually in my work where something fell away. I didn't know how, what I'm going to do to substitute the access to something. You know, it was just too expensive. So I wanted to get rid of it. I'm just using this as an example because uh, I was guided to share it, but I just found a free way of getting the same information without not having to pay. So it just helped me work wise. Um, but I literally said, I was kidding around with somebody. I, like I was like, oh my God, that is, this is so brilliant. I can't believe I just found this. Um, that I was paying so much money for like this access of information that I needed for my work when I could just find it another way for free. Anyway, unlimited ideas. I almost feel like they're helping us in that kind of way when we are making our moves and strategize to make things happen. And they're saying you deserve this and it's coming in. So in the fleeting moments, like any ideas you get that just fly in to follow through and trust that because I swear they're giving you unlimited ideas. So here we go. Your mind is one with God's infinite mind. I'll say that again. Your mind is one with God's infinite mind. Therefore, you have complete access, complete access to unlimited ideas guaranteed to bring blessings. And they're saying you deserve it. They're saying you deserve it. Yes, all you need to do is to take divinely guided action to allow those ideas to come to fruition that's all you have to do just like i just that's why they probably maybe want to uh, mention what just happened at my work which is kind of insignificant but it's an example of you get a little nudging it's as simple as that let me try this let me see this and it's helping you with the strategy and the moves to success it's unlimited you are one with god's mind i mean that is so powerful and so literally and they're saying you deserve it so that's why i have waves and i almost have tears in my eyes because that's the love when i always say about love support backing that is the love so you deserve this how did i have this set up like you deserve this they're giving it to you you're sitting here they're giving it to you unlimited ideas and ways to strategize and you deserve it and and remain coming from your heart and you're helping other people other people are also helping you as you make your moves and everything else but you are one with god's mind and the angels and it's almost like they're sending you the ideas and the and the help with the moves like something just comes into your mind just follow through that's what they literally just said all you have to do is take divinely guided action and allow those ideas to come to fruition and you deserve it i love these two cards if i had to sum up every reading i've been posting about it it's like you have divine help and support Support. all you have to do is follow through when you receive all you have to do is follow through and they're helping you with the moves it's so brilliant talk about brilliant uh strategies that you they always say you're not doing it alone and you deserve it you deserve it i just love that for august so you deserve it so let's step into real divine abundance messages so these are 88 spirit messages that are going to help us let's see what comes out when it comes to this real divine abundance that they're helping us with the strategy, with the moves, and just follow through on the ideas that you might get that just might fly in, that they're there to support you, and that you deserve it. Oh, I love that. I'm going to say that to my son. You deserve it. You deserve it. You deserve it. So just follow through on any kind of brilliant ideas or anything that you get. So three right away want to come through. I think this one was the first one. Divine abundance is constantly being divinely created for you. Yes, of course, because literally it is unlimited, unlimited. The ideas are so are such the pathway to real divine abundance. And they're saying real divine abundance is constantly being divinely created for you. You deserve it. I mean, so hold that in your heart, right? 
We have no kneel. This is a recurring message. Remember I said, baby, you can do it. Take your time, do it right. No need to feel rushed or hurry. Take your time. There's something about time. There's something about time going on in August where don't feel rushed. Take your time. It will help you with the strategies and the moves to make. You do not have to feel hurried or rushed. Take your time. You're right within divine timing. You know, it's constantly created. So you're right in sync, no matter what it feels like. And stay, because right, it's a sentence. Stay in tune with your own energy, knowing when it needs to be adjusted, rested, or uplifted. So they want you to know that divine abundance is always being divinely created for you. And you don't even have to feel rushed or hurried at all. There's something about taking your time and staying in tune with that, with your own energy, knowing when it needs. It's okay if you need to take a time out to adjust, rest get uplifted, you're still right in sync. You're still in right in this divine, divine abundance creation, you know, being created for you. There's something about this because even in the Akashic Records, when it was the ascent, making your steps, it, there was something about take good care of yourself over and over and over again. Sorry, as I hit the camera, but um, don't feel rushed. Don't feel hurried. Stay in tune with your own energy, knowing when it needs to be adjusted, rested, or uplifted. That's really, really important to take really good care of yourself and tune into yourself a lot. Like during the day, periodically check in. Like, do you need to slow down? Do you need to take a break? Do you need to take a rest? Do you need to, you know, what do you need? Um, and at the same time to know that you don't need to feel rushed or hurried. You're, you're right in tune. You're right in time with everything here. That's what they're saying. So there's no need to feel rushed during this time. Um, so let's tap in right now to uh, Divine Spirit Messages. So this is an explanation mark because that has come out before. So I feel like they're really... Uh, summing it all up and, and but I love this unlimited and you, you deserve it so they're helping you with the moves no doubt about it definitely follow through on the ideas that you're getting because they, they're helping you with the strategy and the moves but there's something about time here where you don't have to feel rushed you don't have to feel hurried you're right within divine time there's something about giving you peace and to take care of your own energy yes you can find a way beyond this yeah you have unlimited ideas so whatever's going on that you're trying to move, make your moves and strategize to find ways beyond things, they're help, that's what they're helping you with. That's what they want you to know. That's the strategy and the moves that they're giving you. And right away we're getting, you can surrender it now. Yeah, that's what they want. Like my shoulders just went down. There's something about this, like trust. They're helping you with the moves so you can surrender whatever you were holding in your body, in your mind, stressing about that you're connected to this, that they're helping you with this. Um, it's almost like having more faith in that, that they're helping you with the moves beyond things. It's you're connected, I love it, one with God's mind. I mean, that you're getting the ideas and the strategy and the moves. So we are getting, yes, spirit has your back with this. What did I say? Spirit has your back with this. Deserving, unlimited ideas. Spirit has your back with this. Wow. You are being divinely moved right now. You are being divinely moved right now. These are the moves. Like, they're helping you with the moves and the way to make the moves and how to make the moves, when to make the moves. You are being divinely moved right now. These are the moves. Um, they are divinely moving you. Um, it's time to stretch yourself. So whatever we're going beyond, we remember, oh, it literally just said beyond. We're going beyond, right? You can surrender whatever you've been holding in your mind and heart. We're, we're going beyond now, right? It's time to stretch yourself, to be divinely moved. Spirit has your back with this. They're saying you're deserving and there's you're unlimited, unlimited. So it's like follow through with the ideas that you're getting and we're getting yeah, show up and be there fully now show up and be there fully now that's what they're saying about you your heart we are all one it's like show up fully in your heart space um show up and be there fully now so whatever you're doing like they said it's like we're all showing up for each other we're all helping each other as we're making the moves you're not doing it alone there's probably good relationships they're connecting here but show up and be there fully now and they're helping you um quite literally wow 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 you deserve it and unlimited i love this your mind is one with god's infinite mind therefore you have complete access to unlimited ideas yes 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 it's guaranteed to bring blessings all you need to do is to take divinely guided action and allow those ideas to come to fruition and show up and be there fully now 
I mean, that's that's it. It's like follow through. Um, okay, let's get the divine, let's get the pure love from spirit because they're looking at you like this. And so whatever you're getting, whatever they're giving you, just follow through and show up and be there fully now. It's helping you with the moves. They said you're being divinely moved. It's time to stretch yourself and go beyond things. Yeah, you're being divinely moved. It's time to stretch yourself. Spirit has your back with this. Show up and be there fully now. So there's something about just going forward. Whenever you get a great idea, just go forward on it. Know that you deserve it. That's your love support backing. I love this deservedness. Should we say this again? Sometimes we need to hear this over and over. You are a beloved child of God like everyone else, and you deserve to receive the support that will allow you to focus upon your divine life purpose. Yes, even if you can't yet recognize your lovable qualities, trust that God and the angels can see how amazing, how amazing you really are. And we kept on getting, we know how good you are over and over and over again recently. So they're giving you this unlimited ideas. That's unlimited divine abundance. Just like they said, divine abundance is constantly being divinely created for you. It's divinely being created for you. So there's something about don't feel hurried. Don't feel rushed. You can tune into your own energy. Take care of yourself if you need a time out. <laughs> you know, um, if you need to adjust or rest or uplift, it's still right in divine timing. It's being divinely created. So so spirit definitely has your back right now. You're being divinely moved right now to go beyond this, like surrender and go beyond and stretch yourself and show up there and be there fully. Wow. Okay, so let's get the pure love from spirit right away. Yeah, because this is why when I get those things, I'm getting chills and I get tears in my eyes. And if you're reacting that way, like it, it feeds your heart or you're getting tears in your eyes, especially deservedness. And, uh, you know, spirit as you're back with this, they want you to know we know how you feel. We know how you feel. I almost feel like that's why I, we know how you feel. That's why I feel that uh, we're getting these messages. They, you know, these messages mean a lot. Yeah, and they want you to be happy. We know how you feel and we want you to be happy. That's what it is. Spirit has your back. I'm telling you, we know how you feel and we want you to be happy. Spirit has your back with this. There definitely, there's a deservedness here that just brings tears to my eyes. They're giving you unlimited ideas and all you have to do is like follow through because they're definitely helping you with literally the moves. You also, they want you to unburden yourself. Like you don't even need to feel rushed or hurried. Take your time. There's something about stay in tune with your own energy. Take good care of yourself. But you are being divinely moved now and they know how you feel right now. They want you be happy so this is all the moves for i would say abundance and more form, forms and also the moves to be more happy the way to be you know make the moves and be more, have more happy yeah because they're saying we want you to do what you love yeah we want you to do what you love so if, if this is all about we know how you feel they want you to do more of what you love and we want you to be happy so it's like what they're supporting spirit has your back with this so anything that's the moves that's bringing in more happiness you know that's a form of real divine abundance um they want you to be happy they know how you feel so anything that is making you happy um that's what they are encouraging you to you're being divinely moved so and spirit has your back let's see if there's anything else but i love this just yeah we're gonna send you some help exactly and do you see where this flipped off you can't you can't lie it's right under the connector we're gonna send you some help so wherever it is with the moves that you're making for real divine abundance they're sending you some help now that's a recurring message whether they're literally giving you those unlimited ideas that you just have to follow through on here's the unlimited ideas you're one with god's mind right giving you ideas that's the help, direct help. But I also said you're getting help from others. They're going to send you some help. So people will be coming on your path. You know, whether I said it was like helpful people in your work, in your personal, they're connecting you with the right people. And that's a repeating message. So they are definitely, and they're saying you deserve it, which you can't say it more. <laughs> you can't say that enough. They want you to show up there and be there fully. Now, spirit has your back with this is a recurring message for the hundredth gazillionth time but they also know how you feel and so they're sending you some help they want you to be happy and they're definitely helping you with the moves now this is a recurring recurring message that they're helping you with the moves and so they're helping you with the moves with the unlimited ideas that could come in all you have to do is follow through and then they're also helping you connecting you with helpful people and i love this card because this is the energy that gives me goosebumps in my heart full and tears in my eyes that you deserve it that you deserve this that's your love support backing i want to end up with this because 
I love this card so much. You are a beloved child of God like everyone else and you deserve to receive the support that will allow you to focus upon your divine life purpose. And even if you can't yet recognize your lovable qualities, trust that God and the angels can see how amazing you truly are. And over and over and over, we kept on saying, we know how good you are. We know how good you are. And um, they're definitely sending you some help and helping you with the moves. They are definitely. And just take really good care of as much as they're helping you with ideas and connections and all of this and feeling no need to rush or feel hurried and stay in tune with your own energy and be there for yourself. If you need downtime, you need to rest. They're saying if it needs to be adjusted, rested, uplifted, you do that and you trust the whole time you're right within divine timing. There's something about it because it helps you to surrender and have more peace because there's something about that. They're helping you to go beyond and spirit has your back with this and look at every Everything that was with helping your back. <laughs> I mean, how's your back? With the deservedness, you're, they know you're coming from your heart space. They're connecting you with helpful people and they're helping you even with the moves, with the ideas. And yeah, and they, they know how you feel. They know how you feel. That's why we have all these. So take good care of yourself and you're definitely getting help with the moves indirectly and directly. I wish you the best for August for Real Divine Abundance. Take care. Bye-bye.